Gamuda Burhat is set to conduct a study on the impact of land reclamation proposed in the Penang Transport Master Plan. Gamuda Subsidiary, SRS Consortium, is a project delivery partner for the 27 billion ringgit master plan. The next step ahead of us is what I call the due process, uh, meaning the, the, the detailed studies uh, which will uh, analyse all the impacts, uh, uh, the environmental and the social impacts, uh, uh, the next few months. Uh, and when that is completed, uh, the public will have a very good view of it. The study will be ready for public sharing in six months at the earliest. Lean adds that the Penang state government is currently holding talks with several stakeholders on the project. Turning to Gamuda's property projects, Lean says the group has invested over 2 billion ringgit in three townships, with an additional 2 billion ringgit for infrastructure in the townships. In, in 2016, uh, we will probably do another uh, three, three and a half billion. So that will bring us to about seven, seven and a half billion, uh, which is uh, the kind of gearing that we are comfortable with. Uh, the gearing of about 0 0.7. For calendar year 2015, Lin says Gamuda has spent about 4.5 billion ringgit, including for projects in Vietnam, Singapore and Melbourne. As for its construction sector, Lin thinks it's a good time to invest in infrastructure as these projects will have multiplier effects that are beneficial to the economy. I think for the construction industry overall, it, it should be uh, positive eh? because the government is embarking on uh, a lot of railway projects. Lin was speaking after Gamuda's AGM in Shah Alam. Shah Chong, DHTV.